This reminds me of a newer version of What is Your Purpose, written in my first book, There Still Can Be Virtue. Too many times I went through life without the wisdom that was given to me, and it left me more than just being disappointed. The title of this poem is called Disappointed Purpose. Word to the wise was a saying in disguise that had a lot of truth for those still in their youth. Youthful way of thinking that deeds can be done without linking. Wisdom and understanding, soon their souls will be demanding. Demanding that they stop the chase, for the fountain of youth is not the race any of us should ever participate in, because in the end, the devil, not us, will be laughing. People and things in life have a purpose, and that purpose isn't known when looking just on the surface. But if we step back and allow God to show us the big picture, we'll allow God's wisdom to be our permanent fixture. When this is done, we allow him to guide our focus. His rays of light and understanding, like rain, will soak us. But if we choose to ignore God, our purpose may be disappointed because we relied on our youthful wisdom and not God's anointed. In Proverbs chapter 15, verse 22, it says, Without counsel, purposes are disappointed.